All right, so here's a quick walkthrough of my 2016 Golf GTI with performance pack. So I picked this up about three months ago and I've already done quite a bit to it. It's uh, lowered on VWR springs. It's got Voisteiner wheels wrapped in Michelin Pilot Sport, uh, Sport 4S's, I think, 245 width. Um, the rear has ECS wheel spacers, 15 millimeters, so I could get decent fitment. Uh, tinted the windows 20%, and then the front windshield has 50%. It's got an integrated engineering uh, intake APR stage one software tune. Uh, it's, it's a blast, I love it. I have a stock exhaust right now, soon to be full APR. Uh, I put this, my brother got this for me. I don't really know what brand this is, but I like it. I wanna wrap the rest of the roof gloss black because the, uh, the ones with the sunroofs come with like this half gloss black. I have the SE package, so it comes with the leather seats, which I really like over the plaid. Um, I've got the monster mats, I say GTI on it. Six speed manual, of course. Um, it's got the Fender audio system. 2016, I didn't know when I bought this car, it comes with Apple CarPlay. It also comes with a bunch of other things that I don't use, like a lot of information comes up on here. You could do like your onboard boost gauge. You could configure, apparently it's off by like 15 PSI because of atmospheric pressure. So I never, I'm always on Apple CarPlay. Um, what else in this car? I mean, I really love this car. The hatch is great, I'm moving out pretty soon and I've fit so many things back here, all my boxes. I fit a 60 inch TV in here. I have these, these are real carbon fiber mirror caps, but I don't know if I'm going to put them on. I kind of like the silver in my trunk pack, full of car cleaning stuff. One thing that all GTI owners should have is a Swiffer duster. <laughs> I was told to not really put any product on this like material because it could crack or it could get really, it could wear down. So instead I just swiffer dust it. The interior stays pretty clean. I love this car. I'm gonna do a lot more to it. Like I said, we're gonna do the uh, APR stage two crackles and pops, full three inch cat back exhaust. And after that, I don't really know what else I'm going to do to this thing. Maybe the clutch will blow eventually, but it's on the stock clutch. All right, give you a little pull, stage one, intake. And she moves pretty good. Intake makes pretty cool noises.